So I'm only going to the assume. Loyalty Give is, me what it is. Ebu, the loyalty is. Tell me so that you're not you that she with made this up person. With. That's, yes. That was your problem. Yes. But that's what I've been asking. So that I would know. Let me not see it on social media. Are you guys sure Katrina stayed in the house for only two weeks? Because so far so good in this reunion, she has featured in almost every episode. And today's episode was like all about Katrina and Lucy. Majority of like, in fact, I'll just say the episode was all about Katrina. Because Lucy featured at the beginning, then towards the end we had Tochi that came into the picture. And then at some point we had Katrina, um, Kaisha that came into the picture. But Katrina featured in... <laughs> Every gist that had to do with tonight's reunion, and apart from that, like almost every um, episode, she had something to say. So it's almost like so far so good. Katrina is the leading character, and someone will now begin to ask, like, are you sure it's only two weeks that she said in the house? Because she knows a lot. <laughs> she knows a lot. She has said a lot. But let me just talk about like everything in detail. The major highlights that we would have had tonight. That person that cut it off. Whoever the camera guy is, I don't want to send on that to you. But how could you cut off when we're about to see crazy <laughs> from Lucy? Let me just leave that one. So, welcome back to my channel, guys. If you're new to the channel, please do subscribe and turn, up, turn on your post notifications so that you can get notified each time I post a brand new video. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and drop a comment on what you think about the reunion so far. So, today's reunion, they started by talking about Katrina on following like almost all the housemates. I think she's only following three housemates. So Ibuka asks like, is there anybody here that Katrina is following on social media? And um, Kidwara raises his hand, Doris raises his hand. I don't know who the third person was, but she's only following three of the housemates. And Lucy was not included in the people that she's following. So apparently she unfollowed Lucy. And you guys know that in the house, she was very close to Lucy. So Ibuka just wanted to know like, what was the reason for um, her unfollowing people? Katrina said that for her, she, felt like um after she left the house because she left the house early after she left she got to see that okay the housemates felt a certain way about her so it's almost like okay she didn't feel like anybody really liked her there so like what's the point of uh, following them so she had to like unfollow most of them then i think some of the unfollowing happened after they also left the house it's not all the it's not everybody that she unfollowed while they were still in the house she unfollowed some of them after they left the house as she was talking palani badge now you know entered the equation and said that she feels like it was after nengi's party that katrina unfollowed most of them so that was a i don't know. see yeah, the way the husbands are coming in with their own responses to things it's almost as if they say oh, yeah you say this you say this because <laughs> They were asking Katrina and then Talani Bad had her own, had something to say. And um, Talani Bad said she feels like it was because of Nengi. And then Watoni said, Watoni is another person that has featured in almost every episode. Although her own is because um, she had, she was in different triangles, trapezium square, all of the, all of the above. So that one is a little bit understandable. So today she said that um, she feels like the reason Katrina unfollowed uh, people is because she wasn't getting as much attention from them. And she felt like, okay, because Katrina was not getting engagement from like the housemates and so many other people, she just decided to cut herself up from, cut herself off from most of the housemates. That was Watoni's own view. So if you can ask, oh yeah, now what about Lucy? What was the issue between you and Lucy that obviously if you felt this kind of way about the other housemates lucy is one person that did not say bad things about you when you left the house so what was your reason for following lucy and by the way katrina said it was not because of um, nengi's issue that it was not after that she had unfollowed a lot of them even before the nengi's party but most of them noticed then so i kind of understand her i although i think there were some people that she unfollowed at that nengi's like after the nengi's um, equation i think Lucy was one of them. Then the other people, maybe they did not realize that they were unfollowed already. So Lucy's own, she not started addressing Lucy's situation. She's not said that she didn't want to address it, that she's going to get emotional. Then when she now started talking, she now started crying. And I'm like, ah, what's going on? Let's just say I wanted more because I wasn't friend with everyone. I just wanted to be committed. She now we're talking about how loyal she has been to Lucy. That when Lucy, um, that... The, the the reason she became close to Lucy in the house, I think when she became close to Lucy in the house was when they had an issue. And then Lucy now went to her bed and was crying. Dorothy now came to tell her that Lucy was crying. And she now went to, um, she went and knelt down beside Lucy's bed and was like, you know, apologizing to her and telling her that, you know, she should stop crying, that she's not going to do that to her again. And that's when they became close. So from then on, she now carried the friendship on her head. Like, okay, this person is my friend. This is the person I consider to be my friend. And then when she left the house, you guys know that Lucy was, you know, talking about her and everything. And Katrina too, on the outside, was hyping Lucy, you know, like, okay, vote for Lucy, vote for Lucy. She was all about Lucy. Lucy too was, a, Lucy too was about her in the house. So she was talking about the fact that she traveled to Port Harcourt. I'm just giving you guys details. <laughs> details because... 
They gave us details, so I'm giving you, I'm giving you details as well. So, um, Katrina said she was in Port Harcourt and she had to travel. Um, where she had that, I think when Lucy was evicted, she had to travel to Lagos first flight and then went to Lucy's hotel and was trying to make sure that she was okay. She was following up with her, following up for all her interviews. She was just trying to explain how loyal she has been as a friend to Lucy. Do you understand? So, um, she expected a, a little bit of loyalty from Lucy and then she, to her, according to her, Lucy was not loyal that lucy had an issue with nengi she mentioned that lucy had an issue with nengi and when lucy now settled with nengi she didn't let her know that's katrina she, um, she only saw it on social media she also mentioned that she had a problem with v that is katrina said she had a problem with v and lucy knows that she had a problem with v and then she just went ahead to just be friends with v without letting her know da, 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 da. so at this point ibuka was now asking okay what exactly is the issue she now said that that's the, that's the point where she was crying she was like lucy would have told her it's not about you being friends with anybody here it it's about? about you talking to me we were talking you never did lucy was now like i can't keep up with all the people that you are beefing with so <laughs> i don't know who i will beefing with i can't keep up i didn't know who you were beefing or not beefing besides you're beefing almost everybody baby it's difficult to keep track um, the only time she even noticed that there was something major was when Katrina unfollowed her and everybody blogs were carrying it. people were telling her that Katrina had unfollowed her she should unfollow Katrina but Katrina said her main issue is with the fact that okay you went ahead to you know be friends with this person and you didn't really let me know like you're not putting me in the loop of like okay you guys are like back as friends and everything but the way she was being emotional i'm like ah, no wow. <laughs> Katrina is actually very emotional, even though the other side of her is like, oh, boss lady and all that, but she's actually very emotional because, like, this is a friendship. Like, we know that when it comes to friendships, let, okay, let me, just, let me just insert my own point of view, like the way I, I see it in this whole Katrina Lucy issue. So, basically, Katrina um, had an issue with some of the housemates, Lucy also had an issue with some of the housemates, and apparently, Katrina um, happened to have um, bought the issue. Like, okay. She feels like if Lucy has an issue with this person, then she should also avoid the person. Do you understand? So maybe Katrina bought Lucy's own beef and Lucy did not buy her own beef. <laughs> then also, also, a lot of people like other people to buy their beef, <laughs> which some people don't think is right. Some people think that that's how their friendship should be. That's, that's the way they see friendship. Like if I, if I have issues with this person, and then you now decide to go out, uh, then you now decide to be close to the person then it's like betrayal betrayal of friendship that's how some people see it and some people some people don't see it that way for me i don't really think people should be buying people's issues do you get i don't really think people should be buying people's issues but it's for me i think it may be difficult to be very close to somebody let's say Let's say, you have, let's say I have an issue with somebody and then my friend is close to the person. I don't know, there'll just be this awkwardness when we are all together or something. I don't know, but I would not expect somebody to buy my problems or I'll not be having issues with somebody because they're not buying my issues and stuff. But some people actually see it that way. Even though Katrina has been like very dramatic about it and she did not address the issue with Lucy before now. But I don't really like to invalidate people's feelings if she feels like that is her definition of loyalty and is, is really hurting her. Hmm? Then Lucy said, she, uh, why didn't they address this thing? That's my own issue. Like, this is something that you'd have addressed since with the person. Not like you just say that because of this disease, you now call the person off. Do you understand? So, that's just, the, like, they spent 30 minutes addressing the whole issue. After their whole 30 minutes of um, their beef, they now asked Kaisha um, about, like, of following. Kaisha said she didn't want to have anything to do with Katrina. And the reason she didn't want to have anything to do with Katrina is because of what Katrina did to her mom. That's Kaisha's mom. Now, they now address the issue. Apparently, there was, they went for, they went boat riding or something like that. They shall went for an occasion, they went out and Kaisha's mom decided to follow them. So she wanted to just, you know, hang out with them. So um, at the outing, at some point, Kaisha's mom said that, um, you know, Kaisha said that her mom wanted to um, take a picture with Katrina. So she told Lucy to go and tell Katrina that, okay, her mom wanted to take a picture with her. She also told her sister to go and tell Katrina that her mom wanted to take a picture with her. So according to her, Katrina told her, Katrina now told the person that came to tell her, that's Lucy's sister, that she should tell her mom to come to where she is to take the picture. So that was where Kaisha, um, that was Kaisha's anger that Why would she tell her mom to come to where she is to come and take picture? That's very disrespectful. In, Ka in Katrina's defense, Katrina said that the reason what happened then was that she didn't she didn't really hear what um, Kasha's sister told her. That she didn't even know that Kasha's mom was there or something like that. But she didn't hear that it was Kasha's mom that wanted. She heard her manager. So 
in Katrina's defense, she said she thought that it was, you know, her manager that wanted to take a picture with her. That's why she asked the person to come. Then Kaisha did not allow her to talk. <laughs> but I was so calm at you because I didn't want any trouble. And I didn't want you to open your mouth. As in today, I don't even know, but can I share somebody that if she has a particular perception, a particular thing in her head, there's nothing that you want to see that will change the way she's thinking. And then sometimes she takes, she might take things like too far. I don't know. Do you understand? So there's nothing that wants to change whatever you, like she didn't even allow Katrina to speak. Katrina was trying to explain to her that this is the, this is what she felt. According to Katrina, Kaisha's sister came to her first and she didn't hear her. According to Kaisha, Lucy was the first person that went to meet Katrina and she, she feels like Lucy actually told her that it was her mom. Katrina now said that Lucy came to her after Katrina, um, Kaisha's sister had already come to her. So there was a little bit of, there was a misunderstanding there. Let me just put it that way. Kaisha did not allow Katrina to even speak. She was like, she should keep quiet, da, 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 da. That it means that Lucy was lying to her. Then Lucy was like, ah, what is she talking about? Like, like lying in, in what way? She now made reference to some things. Then Lucy now um, was trying to, Lucy was trying to be confrontational. Like, we need to clear this whole thing. And then Kaisha was like, she doesn't want to talk about it again. And nobody should say anything again. Everybody should shut up. <laughs> that this has to do with her mom. So nobody should say what they feel. Nobody should talk about their opinions. She has said her own and she has said her own. That they should keep quiet and listen. They were like, okay. Yes, ma. So at this point, Lucy was trying to like get something out of the situation. Like, okay, my you've already talked about me, so let's settle this. And then Kaisha was now got angry. Lucy now said some things that got to her. She now got angry, now threw her pillow. Eh? It's not everybody there, so throw pillow. Guys. <laughs> um, Lucy now rushed out. And she I think she, I don't know, see eh? She rushed her to give her a slap. But that's where they caught it. I just told you not to talk anything about my mom anymore. Is it fruit? Your mom just is fruit? respect yourself. I said fruit. Why is it fruit? Are you lying? Show us now. Like, <laughs> stop cutting these things out. Even though maybe it's because of censorship and the fact that it may affect them posting online. But like, you know, it's just a hot slap. Now show us something. I don't know how the fight um, went on. I don't know how the fight ended. But Lucy rushed to give her a slap and da 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 da. But the gist that we're here, no, we're re we already had we had already had this gist online. We had a um, Lucy beat um, Kaisha, so that's what I wanted to see, Sha. Then they now said that they now asked Tochi his own views on the matter. Tochi now said that he feels like Katrina is like all bossy and everything, and that what was annoying him was the fact that even after Katrina unfollowed them, she still went on Twitter to justify her unfollowing, like. If she unfollowed you, means that you don't mean anything to her and everything. So, Tochi was just going on and on and on and on. And Katrina, um, Katrina was like, this is the reason why I unfollowed you guys. Like, I felt like you had this perception about me. And then Tochi too, on his own, was now saying that um, this is because of how you treated people in the house. That you're very bossy and everything. That the way you treated people in the house, that's why um, they see you this way. Which also validated her point. Because he's saying that um, people in the house, they don't care about her. And they saw her to be a certain way. And Katrina is saying that this is the same thing too, that she feels like they perceive her in, they perceive her to be a certain way. That's why she decided to cut, cut herself off. So Tochi was saying the same thing she was saying, but was still attacking her on top of the matter. And I'm like, Tochi, calm down, calm down. I know you're trying to make a point, but like, you need to really calm down. Because he was really shouting and I'm like, what is really, what is really getting to you here? We mean because after you left the house, a lot of people could, a lot of people cooked, and surprised. they shared the food. I, I remember when Lilo. So at some point he was like, he doesn't like bullies, he doesn't like this, da 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 da. That he doesn't care. I'm like, okay, if you don't really care about this person, then what she's saying on Twitter, all those things should not really be your problem. So they just, they were just having their. That's when they were not having their back and forth, Katrina and Tochi, and I'm like, so is that all you have for us today? That's all we had today, guys. So there was nothing major again that happened today. Apart from the fact that um, Katrina mentioned that after that thing happened between um, her, um, Kat Katrina and Kaisha's mom, Kaisha came and pushed her head, removed her glasses. She was violent towards her and everything. But apart from that, that's all that they did for us today. Thanks for watching, guys. And don't forget to give you a big, big thumbs up. And I'm going to see you guys in my next video. Bye. Love you.